Hello children, good morning. How are you? Yes, today is day 20 and we are in the week 5th. So, we are going to complete our session on Friday. Right children? And we are going to start with a new session that is 4th session. Okay, so let's begin this session with a welcome song. Are you ready for it? Yes. Hello everyone. Yes, Zuzu is here too. Welcome you all. Come on, let's sing the song. Hello everyone. Hello everyone. How are you today? How are you today? Hip, 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 hip hooray. Hip, 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 hip hooray. Hello boys, hello girls, hello parents. How are you today? How are you today? Hip, 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 hip hooray. So welcome all of you. Yes, welcome all kids, all parents. And this was the welcome song and... Today is the day 20. So let's begin with the agenda of today. Greeting rituals we just completed. Then comes this SEW time where we discuss the special skill of the day, everything about day, date and month of the year and W weather for the day. Then comes the rhyme session which you enjoy very much. And literacy symphonics and then we are going to do the worksheet. Active exploration is there afterwards and understanding my word. Yes. So let's start with a special skill of the day. Children, what you all have to do today? You have to water the plants at your house and you have to ensure that they do not fade away due to heat and sun. Okay, you have to water them daily. Yes, children, are you going to do? Yes. So show me your thumbs like this. Wonderful. Great. So after doing this activity, yes, as usual, you have to wash your hands regularly and for 20 seconds. The, this is the calendar of August month and today is, yes, which date is today? Today is 5th of August, isn't it children? So can you tell me the day? Yes, can you tell me? It's the Wednesday, right children? So, parents, this is the calendar you can uh, prepare like this type of calendar, okay? And you can see here date, date, month and you can change the day and date, weather is there, seasons are there, different seasons. So, uh, uh, it is adjustable calendar and you can uh, ask questions related to uh, everything about day, date, month and the weather, okay? This is the chart you can prepare like this. This is specially I have displayed for parents. So... Days of the week. Children, we are going to recite the days of the week. Are you ready? Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday and Saturday. So children, are we going to sing the song of days of the week? You remember the song I have taught to you? So let's begin. Every week has seven days. Starting from Sunday. Monday and Tuesday, did you brush your teeth today? Wednesday and Thursday, did you wash your face today? Friday and Saturday, eat your meals every day. Then we come back to Sunday and then we go day by day. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday, Friday and Saturday and we come back to Sunday. So this was the rhyme related to days of the week and now comes the weather for the day. So look outside the window and as usual you tell your parents that how is the weather today. So the rhyme session begins and get ready for rhyme session. This is the first rhyme. Are you sleeping? Are you sleeping? Are you sleeping? Brother John, brother John, morning bells are ringing, morning bells are ringing. Ding, dang, dong. Ding, dang, dong. Let's go for the next rhyme. Out in the garden. Out in the garden one fine day. With my ball I went to play. Out in the garden one fine day. With my ball I went to play. I bounce it right. I bounce it left. I bounce it well on one fine day. Out in the garden one fine day, with my kite I went to play. I flew it right, I flew it left, I flew it high, 
On one fine day, out in the garden, one fine day. So let's go for the next rhyme. And it is 10 little firemen. So do it with me with action. 10 little firemen slipping in a row. Come on, do it with me, children. 10 little firemen slipping in a row. Ding dong goes the bell. In a wing they go. Ding dong goes the bell. In a wing they go. Off to the engine. Ho, ho, ho. Off to the engine. Ho, ho, ho. Using a big pipe. So, so, so. Using a big pipe. So, so, so. When the fire is out, home they go. When the fire is out, home they go. Back to their bed. All in a row. Back to their bed. All in a row. Yes, and the last rhyme for today is There are birds nest in trees. Let's start. There are birds nest in trees and hi for bees. There are birds nest in trees and hi for bees. Candle for dogs and ponds for frogs. Candles for dogs and ponds for frogs. There are branches for birds and barns for horse. There are branches for birds and barns for horse, houses for cats and field holes for mice. Each has a house, yes, even a mouse. Each has a house, yes, even a mouse. So we have completed children our rhyme session and you must have enjoyed it very much, I know. So let's do the recitation now. You can see here uh, letters A to Z. And we are going to do the recitation with the bodily movement. We are going to swing like this. Come on, raise your hands up and start the recitation. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. So now today we are going to do the review of letter H and we are going to uh, do the revision of a uh, second group, okay, which starts from letter I. So you are going to say the sound, okay, by saying the letters which are coming on the screen. Let's start children. Yes. So which letter is it? Letter I. And what is its sound? I. In pot. I. In pot. Yes, ooh, lamb, ooh, lamb, and the letter is L, that's right. Tell me the letter name, letter name is D, and D says D, 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 drums, D, 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 drums. The next letter you can see on the screen is letter F, that's right. Yes, F, fan, what is the sound? Yes, fan is the keyword. The next one is H and its sound is horse. Now we are going to children read the green words which are displayed on the screen. So tell me how many sounds are there here. One, two, three. Three dashes that means three sounds. So come on, let's recite the sounds. Pit, 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 that's right. The next word is d, a, d, dad, that's right. Once again, we will do d, a, d, dad. Now there are how many dashes? One, two, three, four. That means there are four sounds here. So let's read it. Uh, e, p, slip. S, uh, e, p, slip. That's correct. The next word is of three letters. That means there are three sounds. So let's begin. E, t. Let's do it once again. E, t, fit. 
that's right the next word is yes e u hill e u hill that's right next one is a mm the hand again we will read it a mm the hand so you can see now we have completed that literacy in phonics and now you can see here jumbo elephant has come and now he is requesting you to play the fun game so are you interested yes so what is today's fun game children today you have to balance uh, the book on your head but it is not too easy you have to stand on one foot doing so so parents will show how to do the, the, this uh, how to play this game and then the rest then the children will imitate uh, their parents okay so uh, children will keep the books on their head and stand on one foot and balance it okay so this is the game fun with game enjoy it yes children this is the symphonics worksheet which we are going to do today so let's begin i am going to read the instructions look at the picture and fill in the missing sound again i will read it for you look at the picture and fill in the missing sound so first picture what you can see here we have to look we have to observe what is the picture we have to identify okay and then what is the beginning sound what is the missing sound we have to write that okay so who will tell me the first picture name yes so let's start yes it's hand that's right so what you will write here h that's correct h a n d hand read it h a n d hand now you can see here what is what are these lips u lip u lip so what you will write here L says U. Right here, yes. The next is yes. What is this? Which picture is this? Ink pot. So I says ink pot. Ink. So right here I give a George. Yes. The next one is water drop. So drop d drop d. drop so which letter you will write d says d that's correct d drop d drop next picture is of fish that's correct so it is of fish but they have they have shown something they have circled something so it is fin what is it fin yes so what you will write f but how you will write within these four lines and from where you will start from the dark line to the dotted line so let's begin like this 1 2 3 and then 4 f i n fin say it once again f i n fin that's right the next picture is of yes it is of top but it is spinning spin spin s p E E E says I. That's correct. Mmm says N. E Mmm spin. That's correct. So what we have forgot here, we have forgotten the date. So put the date today's date and complete this worksheet at home. So this was all about worksheet. so the next activity is active exploration in this you have to do origami heart so read the instructions i have sent the uh, video to you please go through it and prepare the origami art and enjoy the craft work
The next one is in active exploration is music and movement. So you have to put on the music, a tutu tata song is there, and you have to do the actions according to the instructions given. That is thumbs up, thumbs down, yes, move, uh, turn around, jump up high. These all types of simple uh, dance movements are there. So uh, go on for the uh, music and then put on the music and then do the actions according to the song. Yes, understanding my world. Here, the concept of nature conservation has been uh, shared with you. So, go through the video. It is uh, uh, also the fun activities have been given there. Fun activities have been given. So, please go through it. And this was all about today's uh, day. Uh, do all the activities and please do send it to me. Thank you very much and have a nice day. Bye-bye.